She's totally thinking about having sex with me. How could she not be? I'm thinking about having sex with me, and I'm me. So, clearly other people are thinking about it too. Oh God, maybe a lot of people are thinking about having sex with me. Even, even people I wouldn't have sex with. That's not fair. Okay, sleep. Tomorrow's a new day, Nate. All the embarrassing things I've done in the past are in the past. Oh God, I've done so many embarrassing things. Just don't think about them, just sleep. Don't think about the time you asked Miranda to dance at the school dance. Shit. Why can't I hear everyone else's thoughts? It was eighth grade. Get over it, Nate. You're an adult now. She doesn't remember. She doesn't remember laughing in your face. Plus, it's not as bad as the time you tweeted the girl at the bar saying, hey, we don't talk that often. Maybe we should talk more. She probably thinks I'm insane. I should just delete my Twitter. That'll show them. That'll show them what Nate Sesco's all about. What the hell am I even talking about? Okay, Alex, think about this. Could you hear people's thoughts before? No. Okay. Am I really hearing people's thoughts now? Or am I just imagining it? And I'm really good at imagining it. Wait! I can hear people's thoughts and I'm great at imagining things? This must mean I'm God! This is ridiculous. I mean, I get it. It's me. But I should not be the star of people's sex fantasies when I don't want to have sex with them. It should be mutual. But I guess if it were mutual, then two people having sex fantasies could just have, have sex. I just changed my profile picture. That probably egged on some people's imaginations. It was a good picture. It had to have. Maybe if I tweeted that girl joking about how weird it was that I tweeted her before, it would defuse the entire situation. That's something a normal person would do, right? No, that's something a stalker would do. Don't do that. Maybe her and Miranda from 8th grade are joking about how creepy I am. Nonsense. They don't even know each other. Oh god, maybe they know each other. If I'm God now, that means anything I think of actually happens. Don't think about a flood. Don't think about a flood. Don't think about a flood in Canada. Damn it! Sorry, Canada. Oh god, Miranda and that bar girl follow each other on Twitter. This can't be happening. They probably have sleepovers and talk about the weird guy they both just so happen to know. I'm their inside joke. It makes sense for porn stars. Have fantasies about them. That's fine. They're paid for that. Models even. They know people imagine them having sex. But me? I'm just a normal guy. I know who I want to have sex with, and I know who I do not want to have sex with. Why can't people respect that? I should start a civil rights movement called Don't Even Think About It. And by it, I mean having sex with me if I don't want you to. Being God is hard. There's so much stuff I can't even think about where it will happen. Like another Dane Cook special. If I think about it, it might happen. That would be awful. But as God, I can make it not happen. I could ruin Dane Cook's career if I wanted. No, he'll do that himself. Oh wow, I've become God and the only thing I've done is destroy Canada and Dane Cook. I'm terrible at this. What if someone imagined having sex with me and it's totally not the type of stuff I do while having sex? Or... What if they imagine bad sex? They're wrong! I'm great at sex! Bastards! Does this mean I can only sleep on Sundays? Okay, not much for praying, but here goes. God, can you make tragic things happen to Miranda and that bar girl so they don't think about the embarrassing things I did to them? Is Nate praying? Not like kill them or anything, that's bad. But maybe like their least favorite pet. So their favorite pet is still there to comfort them, but they're still kind of sad not really thinking about me. Nate, what the hell are you talking about? Alex, why are you replying to my prayers? Are, are you God? I have no idea!